ことを教えてあげましょうか。Something good? 今、プールに行くといいことあるわよ。Okay, we're going to the pool. This clearly mine's there. Also, Miss Yamashiro is kind of trying to set us up together. That's, that's the vibe I've been getting from her. Alright, here we are. I didn't mean to follow up on her hint, but I head over to the pool anyways. It seems the swim club had a meeting. There doesn't seem to be anything special here. As I stand in front of the pool, I hear water splashing. Is someone still swimming? I go up the stairs and look in. There's someone in the pool swimming freestyle pretty fast. I admire how this person is able to keep a steady pace. After a while, she gets out of the pool. Oh! Unexpected. <laughs> Not my. And again, on our <laughs> roll to my path, we see... This beauty, she is 30 years old. I could talk about her this way. That's not that bad. Yukino, that's a better picture. Hey guys, how's it going? Welcome to a new world and video. As you saw just right there, we are trying to get Mai's path that we found Yukino. However, I looked up a guide that we're gonna go through uh, Mai's path here, and I've actually cut it a little bit um, to only important events that kind of, you know, let you feel like you're more connected to Mai when we're on this path. So we're gonna go through that. And the ending is actually very, very good. I love Mai's ending, and you'll see why eventually. But guys, let's get right to the game. Sorry for the long intro. Okay, guys, I have found a guide, and literally this man is my savior. He literally mapped it out in his description of a video where to click on what day, what to do. So I'm going to go step by step on the important stuff. So like I was saying, I don't know if I'm going to show this, but um, we're supposed to be seeing a movie together. And this is what happens um, as I walk into the local shopping district and after a movie catches my eye, forgive me not, it's supposed to be an emotional movie. I suddenly recall that Maya wants to see it. I take a plunge and buy two tickets. I hope this year's are up hate when we yell at each other. I should make a plan B as well. I take out my smartphone. I, I'll cook dinner today. This is where we are. Okay, nothing happened. When Maya comes home, she's apparently in a good mood. I'm so cooking, stop eating in the side dish, please. Hold on, I'll make you a plate right now. I suddenly realized that that's right, I'd forgot my doesn't hold grudges. I think she does, bro. <laughs> with that, she cheerfully goes upstairs. It turns out I didn't need the movie ticket to cheer her up after all. What should I do with it now? We're still gonna go, bro. We're still gonna go. We still gotta go. Head downstairs to the living room. My is toasting bread for breakfast. I tell my that I wanted to take her to see a movie the other day, and she sh I, I, and I show her the tickets. Right. If anything's going to bribe her, it's food. There are only a few show times in the afternoon, so we end up going in the evening. We spend the afternoon hanging out together before we leave. There isn't much of a crowd to the movie theater. Do you think we'll be able to finish that? All the same then, it's on me. She pays for the food before I can say anything else. That's a fair trade. I respect that. The movie is a unique, uh, unique love story. It is rather amusing. In the seat next to me, my seems uh, focused on the screen. I haven't seen her so quiet since the night we met. Really? I thought the part where the protagonist lost all their memory was great. That's true. That usually happens. Is it? Is it? 
のほほんと目的もなく見つけに入ってきた誰かさんとはハートの熱さも違うわけよ hey, hey made me do this whatever I say casually dismissing the insult Well, let's go to the pastiche then, or ocean cafe. I think it's pretty cute to go to a little low class cafe after a movie. I'm not that fancy. What's gotten into her, I think,、uh, but、uh, there's nothing to be done about it. I do the mature thing, which is ocean cafe. Oh, hope to. At least she gave me credit for it, but this is my first time here too. What is iced cocoa? There we go, there it is. I didn't see that coming. We each ordered a drink, 2,000 yen for two drinks. That's a lot for a student. After a little while, our drinks are served. They come with a tropical flower and stuff, so I guess they're kind of cute, fancier than Mew Cafe. They must have chosen this place for a reason. Those who ask for plenty are the poor. That's what world ends. Syndrome, I heard it on、uh, Hikari's radio show recently.、Eh? I can't say that name. Hikari. Not Hikari, it's Hikari. I don't know. Oddly enough, I have, to,、uh, I have listening to, make it,、uh, to it makes me feel at ease. Pretty sure it's mine. I've never really thought about it. Why don't you listen to it yourself? What do you mean? When I first came to the mansion and turned on the radio, that's a show that happened to be on. I thought you might be, still li-、uh, might be listening to it. Now you're making fun of me. Oh, you're making fun of me. ノリで入ってみたんだけど、値段の高さに引きまくってたところです。当たり前でしょ。ここは大人の社交場なんだから。それ飲んだら帰りなさい。あ、山城先生も一緒に行かが。保護者がいれば問題ないでしょ。保護
マインさん伝承っていうのはね人々がその物語や習わしに込めた思いを推測することが最も重要なのだけどね私がどんなに研究を重ねようとその答えは永遠に私の手から遠ざかっていくだってそうでしょ時間は未来にしか進まない真実にたどり着くことは私には許されていない<笑>それが実際の伝承をもとに書いたノンフィクションだってよく言われるけど<笑>私何を言うの、oh, bro, ミスヨンシオ takes a sip from her first class. ミスヨンシオ先生みたいにいい女がほろ酔いでカウンターに座ってたらこの町の男どもは放っておかないでしょうね。残念ながらここでナンパされた記憶はないわね。いいんですかあの指定席に座らなくて。なぜだか最近は座る気にならないの。座る気にな。もうこんな時間。Thank God. <laughs> Miss Yamashiro downs the rest of her amber colored drink. We leave the hotel Miss Yamashiro behind. Oh my gosh, finally. Jeez. I didn't think it was important, so I skipped it. Also, I'm just recording the important stuff and trying to compile them into at least one or two videos. So it is the morning. As I pass through the school gate, I see Mai. I suddenly slow down. There's a male student standing in front of her, one I've never seen before. This is Sagi Mia. Um, I'm not sure if I should approach him. I don't want to walk to him. Okay, he walks away, right? Mai actually walks up to us and says, instead of running away, this is what usually would have happened. So,、um, good morning. Good morning. Who was that? What you don't know? Oh, that's right. You just moved here. Was it something serious? I don't know. I guess it could be serious. What it was it about? He asked me out. What? I said he asked me out. Don't tell anyone. Mai disappears to the entrance. Mai got asked out. I just heard. I just saw. That's where we left off. That voice I turned around nervously. Are you watching? でも安心しろ。Are you sure? 俺を見くびるな転校生よ。It's sad because the soggy likes my. あの週刊スプリングと。That it? そうなんだよ信じられるか。This man, this guy. How does everyone know already? キラン、来たらすでにこの状態だった。偶然聞いちゃったんだよ。上履きに履き替えてたらさ。まあ、さぎ、エクサジュレーニングで。立ち聞きだなんて不謹慎ですわね。ミュウさん、聞くの。相手は。きえ。運動神経。Captain Soccer, okay。こえ。そうだ。前見方ぜ。うれしかった。Oh God <笑>。大げさにしないでよね。でもすごいです。こく。なんで花子がこ。でも。去年の体育祭ケンスなみんなそう OK nothing sorry I'm skipping it because all they were talking about is just who he was so he's an athlete much older than her he asked her out end of story Alright guys so what just happened、um, from the point we just met on instead of Hanako and Mai and me finding the cat it was Yukino Mai and me finding the cat for、uh, Kokona And so we got the, the cat, and it was just, you know, a lot of talk, just, you know,、oh, congrats, you got the cat. There was a radio in her room, whatever. And now we're at an event here. Maya's facing back and forth in front of the mirror of the living room. I have seen this, but I'm not sure if you guys have. She holds a swimsuit up against her body. Is it because you got fat? I think I got this in the last video, but I think I cut it out before I realized we were on Hanako's path. I don't know, I didn't、uh, know you last year. I don't know, I didn't know you last year. My size. I don't know, I didn't know you last year. At first, I'm not sure what she's talking about, but soon I remember that Maya had been asked out last morning. You should do what you like. So, then, eh? Got a minky one, does she? Jake, I'm more so so does she. Me? I don't know. I'm more worried for Saki Mia. For a second, I think she might hit me, but she looks away. Yeah, we have done this before. It's awkward living under the same roof as a married woman. Interesting. That, that usually always shows up if we go to the man at that point. Alright, l we buy a small boutique of flowers on the Sazanami Street. We're, I'm with Mai right now. We left school walking to the station. I believe, yep, we're visiting Coconut. 
ココナちゃんにはまだ早いかもあワールドエンドだこれ今度映画になるやつの本だよねほらここに作者のサインもあるのだ That's why she had a sign There's just a small little thing where she goes to Miss Yamashiro and gets a sign Turns the book around to show us Miss Yamashiro's autograph I also didn't like, care to figure out what's wrong with her, guys. I'm sorry. I, I don't know what's wrong with her. <laughs> First, gonna assume she's sick. Okay. <laughs> Maybe Kokona would rather have uh, Hikaru, uh, Hikaru's autograph. I'm so convinced Mai is this girl now because she visited the hospital and that we've seen her do that plenty of times. Um, then we see that silhouette figure of Hikaru with her voice or whatever. That, it's got to be Mai. And I realized her little strip of hair on the right there, that was what I saw. She was facing backwards. I got it. It's fine. She went all the way to the radio station. I actually would have never guessed, to be honest. Never thought. You're supposed to assume it's Mew, but I wouldn't have assumed it was mine. I would have assumed it was just someone we've never met. Are you sure you should go making promises like that? Where are you going? There she goes again. I wonder, but she's not the type of person to lie. Why do you ask? Kids are so straightforward with their questions. Kokona looks out the window as she says this. Don't be in such a rush, you'll get there soon enough. It's something to look forward to, okay? Kokona beams happily. Aww. <laughs> I think I've always had a soft spot for her and Mimi, but we'll see. I don't think they can kill a kid in this game, can they? <laughs> Alright guys, we are at the uh, manor or whatever on the trip, and this is good. We don't have Hanako coming up to us, we don't have Saya, we have Mai. So as I'm looking up at the tall bookshelf, Mai comes to stand beside me. This town's views on life and death, I feel a lot, uh, like a lot of this town's culture is related to its views on mortality. Dude, that's all of your guys' topic, let's be real. Your topic is the fear of death, hidden in tradition. You made me help you, but thanks to that, I was able to come up with my own topic. I read some of your notes of what you wrote uh, there was pretty inspiring to me, and oh, what you wrote there was pretty inspiring to me, and... Well, you're always leaving them on the table in the living room, so I read them while you were taking a bath. Uh, don't say it like that. <laughs> Wait, Saya. Wait. Hold up now. Stop. Wow, there is some truth to that statement. Her wording really is miss. Hey, Saya, you used to like me. What the hell? <laughs> Shut up, Asagi. This is getting out of hand. You're all mistaken. What I peeked at was Maya's. <laughs> Wait, she's actually so good at the word, the word play. Responsibility, I just read her notes. Suddenly, a dark energy runs up my spine and turn around ever so cautiously. Oh, what the frick? That's scary. Wait, why was she looking at me like that, though? We're in high school, remember? I think about cutting her off to ask who started this whole circus in the first place, but I hold my tongue. I'm taken back by this unexpected proposal. Okay. 
And this is how you repay me. Atashi wa densho. Anta wa fushu. Shirabe te remono a betsu dake do. Nita tema o betsu betsu de hapyo suri yori. Stotsu no men kara hori sageta ho. Since I didn't want to、uh, want to present by myself, anyways, I decided to accept the offer. Fine, I'll leave it to you. All right. Maybe we should listen to this. After lunch, I, in a brief、uh, free time, we did our presentations. First up, okay, yeah, Sagi does her. Atashi no tema wa. Hold on, you mean our report, don't you? Why are you saying it like you did all the work? What is this awful accent? Can I just give my presentation about the pinwheels first then? What is happening? A joke every two seconds is a bit too much. It's not a skip. Damn, now I'm doing it. What was the accent I was supposed to do? I slap me on the back and takes a bow. I follow her,、uh, follow suit. I didn't see the last word. I'll see it. Wait, can I pronounce it? Hurriedly? Hurriedly? Like hurriedly, but like hurriedly? <laughs> You're getting us some comedians, aren't you? Okay. Here in the night. Okay, here we go. I end up changing my clothes and go outside to get some night air. Okay, this is important. I don't think I should be wandering around the garden at night, so I sit on the ver.、Uh, veranda. Is that even veranda? Veranda? Look up the stars. What is a veranda? I never thought I would be leading such a hectic life when I first got off the Mihate Town station. I thought I'd come here just to throw myself away, but. I see a shadow across the field. I squint and look harder. I make out there's actually two people there, one's taller than the other, a man and a woman, maybe. I get up from the well lit veran <laughs> veranda and I have myself in the bushes. It's like I'm spying on them. My body move instinctively. The taller one must be a man. I can hear his low pitched voice. Mibu. He's facing the other、uh, person. His hand touch、uh, touches the other figure's shoulders. Apparently, the other person is a female. Who is it? A voice from behind me suddenly startles me. I scream. Mew, that is, uh. She places her right hand on, my, on her face. Maybe she just can't see well, and like, maybe she has a glass eye, and so she. I don't know. Her eye. I narrow my eyes again and look closer. That long hair, it's, it's definitely my. Suddenly, the two shadows separate and Mibu disappears towards the mansion.、Uh, my, my Mi's shadow is co coming this way. She's heading towards us. Mew, you hide too. When I turn around, Mew's already disappeared. I hear footsteps from in front of the bushes. I, told, I hold my breath and peek through them. Sure enough, it's Mai. When Mai reaches the cottage, she takes a seat on, on the veranda. Veranda! Whatever it is, just where I'd been just a minute ago. I. Wait, what do I do? I guess I'll try talking to her, but more importantly, how should I come out of these bushes? If I just stand up and go, hey, Maya, I look like a stalker. In that case, I'll sneak out from behind the bushes and approach from an angle as if I'd been walking. I gently sneak backwards, trying not to make a sound. A tiny tw twig snaps under my foot. How foolish of me, I stick my head out of the bushes and defeat. Hey, Maya. <laughs> hey, Maya. Couldn't sleep. Of course. Maybe you're always there. I meekly take her verbal abuse. Indeed, sneaking around is disgusting, there's no doubt. Peeping Tom only because you're sneaking around being suspicious. Okay. Don't yell so loud, it's late. You already are. Fine, as long as I'm peeping, let me ask you something. A person you were with,、uh, were with just now, was it Mibu? Here's. Mine turns back on me and as if she's trying to hide her face. No, hold up. Mibu, Mibu has a thing for like younger girls, and you're supposed to think it was with Ray, but he, he wasn't actually doing anything with Ray. It was, in fact, freaking Mai? Why was she crying? Hold up. Wait, I'm actually a little pissed at Mibu here. Mibu is way older than Mai. Nando, my son. 
Sure enough, my arms and legs have been welts all over them. My blood is just tastier. Yeah, I didn't think that was important. Um, okay, yeah, none of that was important. Great. Rick, I missed it. I didn't think it was important. Another day of nice weather. Okay, we go into our mansion. Okay, 1 p.m. then. Maya's talking on the phone. Maya's on the phone in the kitchen. Got it. I just need to call uh, Sagiyama's phone then. Sagiyama. Maya's on the phone, but she hangs up and turns and looks at me. Oh, too. I was thinking about visiting Kokona this afternoon. You want to come with me, Mai? I'm supposed to go out with Sagiyama. Tell Kokona I said hi. She left. Sagi, Sagi Mia, huh? I'm glad to hear that. I'm sorry, Maya. I couldn't come today. She said that she's busy. うん。全然いいよ。毎日ちゃんだって忙しいんだし。手術は来週なの。私がいない間も院長先生が兄ちゃんのお世話してくれるって。She is that it? Not it yet. As I pass in front of the Ocean Cafe, I take a peek inside. Is that mine? Then across from her is Sagimiya. They're seated where uh, they can look out the o over the ocean laughing quietly. Sag Sagimiya looks good as always, casually dressed in a light blue polo shirt. Mai is kind of cute as long as she keeps her mouth closed, so the sight of the two of them is rather pleasant. They seem to be getting along uh, well. I should leave them be. I sneak out of the area taking care that they don't spot me. Usually you go in the cafe and you like literally spy on them. Uh, so it tells me to save here, so I'm going to go ahead and save, just to be careful. Ano? Well, I'm standing in front of the hospital at a night, a voice suddenly calls out to me from behind. I turn to a woman standing there, she looks worn out. Oh, this is the elegant lady. Okay. It says to accept it, so we're just going to go ahead and accept it. We've already we've already done this on Saya's path. I guess we just do this. I We don't need to go through this again. Alright, we're at the hospital of mine. She has a gift. Ma, we got to Kokona's room. Mai's gift is... Yeah, it has to be her. That's a clear giveaway, dead giveaway. When did she... A friend? Which friend? Here's up in Kokona's eyes. Here's well up. Sorry, I'm not sure what I said. That was cute. See Mai coming this way from the station, walking on the side of the street. She doesn't notice me and proceeds to the boardwalk. At this time of night, I wonder if I should get her attention, but in the end, I just end up following her. Mai seems to be heading towards the Kamashiro Hotel. I feel odd to be following Mai like this. Mai is standing alone at the back of the lobby. She looks looking all around her. I start to wonder what she's doing, but before I can get far, a few men approach her and begin speaking with her. They seem to know each other. Um, they're dressed quite casually. One's even in sunglasses. It's dark. Should I... Go interrupt them and pretend it's a coincidence. No, it might seem unusual for me to be here while I'm considering my next course of action. Mibu appears from the back of the lounge. He walks straight to Mai as, a, uh, as his serious expression loosens it into a cheery smile. Mai doesn't seem to greet him, but just stares at him. Instead, I notice that she isn't smiling at all. Mibu places his hands on my shoulder and leads her to the elevator. They leave the other men behind and enter. The elevator door shuts. The men left behind shrug when the elevator leaves. They take seats on the lobby sofa. After Mai. I run to the elevator lobby. Um, so it said I had made that choice before. That's because when I was fast forwarding through all this stuff, I just clicked the first choice. Which floor are they going to? I press the call button. The security man approaches me. He must be the hotel security. I'm thinking about how to respond when a few men come behind pillars and come closer with cameras in their hands. あんたらも記録時中張り込むのはやめてもらえますか。もう今日は出てきません。関係ないのか。
The paparazzi leave with disappointed looks on their face. It seems the media is constantly watching Ray. I'm so worried about mine, but the security guards kicked me out of the hotel almost immediately. What is going on? I'm actually a little pissed right now. What is Mibu doing? 